the capital to capital event in Washington, D.C. that's going to take place May 4th, 2019 to May 8th. Are there direct tangible benefits for Loomis to have a representative at the capital to capital event? There was a debate recently online about the town of Loomis fronting the cost for Mayor Tim and Derko. It was an agenda item on February's meeting, which is why this got brought up. Here's some background info. It is hosted by the Metro Chamber of Commerce. It's been going on for nearly 50 years now. It's considered the biggest networking event of the year. Approximately 400 individuals, give or take. It includes business leaders, business owners, leaders from nonprofit organizations, uh, mayors, elected officials. At the 2018 event, which he did attend, the Sacramento region was able to secure $1.8 billion for flood protection projects. Other accomplishments included obtaining funding for workforce development. In the past, there was also $50 million of federal funds that was earmarked for the Sac Street car project. What's this year's uh, cap to cap event all about? Well, the theme is collaboration. The idea is to unite on some key issues for this year, such as infrastructure, regulatory reform, and workforce development. In D.C., these representatives will have an opportunity to talk with federal representatives in Congress about the agreed upon talking points to try to obtain federal funding. Town manager Sean Rebe said as far as interest is for Loomis, it could be everything from infrastructure, transportation, funding to funding for grants for various purposes, business related issues, protecting local control, etc. In the past, former Councilman Miguel Yukovich and former Mayor Sandra Calvert have attended the event. The Transportation Commission fronted the bill. The town of Loomis uh, did at one point pay half of Tom Millward's trip to D.C. and the committee he was on paid the other half. So far it appears that Mayor Tim Indirico has been the first D.C. trip paid for by Loomis. After reviewing the town council minutes for 2018, a former council member, Miguel Yukovich, was not in favor of reimbursing Mayor Tim and Derko for the Cap to Cap conference. I reached out to him to, if he could elaborate a little bit more. And he had said, you know, from past experience, he didn't see the value of the town paying for the trip. He thought the cost was too high. His opposition at the February 13th, 2018 meeting comes from personal experience having attended the events. I, I did reach out to Mayor Anderko for comment. I did not get a response back at this time, but if we do have an opportunity to talk, I'll be sure to uh, update the community on that. Mayor Tim and Derrico did make a statement on Facebook regarding the Capital to Capital event, but just to give you a little snippet, he said, uh, it's important for Loomis to have a seat at the regional level. The economy functions on a regional basis, and what happens in Roseville, Rockland, Sacramento, and other communities affects Loomis. One of our many jobs as elected representatives is to keep our eyes and ears out for the town's best interest. This is one way to do it. Again, I'll, I'll be sure to post his, his full statement online for you to read and review. With that said, working as an elected official is the ultimate networking job. Without good relationships, really nothing can be accomplished that benefits you as an individual or even, even a, a community, I suppose. So, uh, you know, the question is, are there benefits? Are there direct, tangible benefits for Loomis to have a representative at the capital to capital event?